It is 40,000 square feet and where as many as 2,400 trainees each year will get the skills they need to start a new career in wind energy. But big numbers aside, at its core, Siemens Energy's new state-of-the-art wind service training center is about one simple thing. Having the capability to, to train our people here, to be able to service all of the, the wind turbines that are coming, I think uh, will give us a big competitive advantage and, and create a big business opportunity for us. The wind industry is exciting. The jobs are exciting. You do that work up in 300 feet. And how do you get trained for it? And it's, you know, taking what's up 300 feet down to the ground and train everybody, you know, our technicians real life, that's exciting. The facility's hands-on safety and technical training programs feature the latest wind technologies and include two full-size wind turbine generators and three 30-foot high climbing towers, all to help make a future technician's training, safety, and rescue simulations look and feel very real. State and local leaders helped cut the ribbon on the Orlando, Florida facility, which was built according to LEED Gold Certified Green Building Standards. You know, when we talk about all these jobs, it always, if you, if you think about it, it always comes down to families. So these are 50 families and these are well-paying jobs. It's one of those double economic development type of situations because you have the permanent jobs, but you have the indirect jobs because you're going to have 2,400, 2,500 trainees that come and stay in our hotels, use our international airport, visit our restaurants. According to the Department of Energy, between 2002 and 2011, the amount of electricity generated in the United States by wind grew on average by nearly 30 percent each year. Today, that means over 15 million typical American homes are powered by wind energy. And as that number continues to climb, it shows wind is gaining ground as an important part of our energy mix. And our investment here in this new wind training facility, I think, underscores our strong commitment to supporting the long-term growth of the wind industry in the U.S. I'm Jay Curtis.